Hi friends. Welcome to 30 inks, 30 days, day 28. <laughs> In which Coco is being teased lovingly. <laughs> Let's start off looking at yesterday's splat, Tsutsuji. Glorious, lovely, super pink, but you can see some of that gold sheen. And if you remember, I was kind of curious if it showed up on the um, MD <laughs> cotton. And it does. Let's see. I don't know if you can see it, but anyway, that's yesterday. So today, you pen new ink, new drink. And for the ink, we're going to Mexico and going with Cenote from Monarca. I hope you all appreciate how much I'm trying to do matchy-matchy here. For the pen, I got my Twisby Eco in Sapphire Blue with a medium nib. Um, and for our drink, I have Planter's Punch. Mm, nice. Assertive. <laughs> He's gonna require kind of a lot of rolling around to get the shimmer uh, distributed. So, probably pause and we'll be back here. Okay, here we are. Um, got our materials, our pen and ink, related accoutrement, and we got the jar open, bottle, jar, whatever. Well, not much ink, but probably fine for 30 being 30 days purposes disappointing in other regards um, syringe is ready okay we're gonna cap this again I'm worried that if I don't, if I ever just set the cap on, I'm going to forget and then just go, hmm, I better shake this up again. And then we will have a horrible incident. So let's go. Let's see if this writes down here. We have. Monarca, Cenote, Twisby Eco, Sapphire Medium, and Planters Punch. Now we can do our automatic pen. Oh, perfect, perfect. The neck of this bottle is kind of narrow. That's the problem I'm running into. Do the people who make fountain pen inks like own fountain pens? And know that this is like really narrow. Okay, y'all, that is so much ink. We got so much ink. Sucking it up and having splats 
premature splats on my desk over here. It's fine. But some awesome stuff is happening in my little cleaning thing. Coco's over here like, um, is this for me? No, darling. Okay. It was the Sprite thing to get some of that ink off for reals. Because it's still a lot of ink. And you can actually see, since that took a while, maybe you can see the shimmer. I don't know. My lighting is suboptimal. No, that page almost closed. Okay, more writing. Some deep meanings, lady days, April 2024. Date, uh oh, there's like ink blobbing. Day 28. What I did is I pushed out some air and then I pulled in air. So hopefully pull that ink in, which means it's gonna like kind of dry now, but that's okay. Ink, Monarca, Note, Pen, Frisbee, Eco, Sapphire, the medium nib, Drink, Lantern's Punch, Animal Companion, Coco. Yeah, I saw you saying your name. It's been a while since I was responsible for taking care of a dog. Easy to forget things. Yeah, I had an idea. Come here. In case you don't know, cenote is like when you have like a cave with the opening that goes to the sky. I don't know if it has to be at the water. They're the I, I every time I see a picture of one, like a professional photo of one, you're like, oh, that's so beautiful. I want to go there. Look, this is like a, a exploding headed slug with its arms out, going, yay! I am the ruler, right? Y'all see that too? You know, just me. Glad to hear it. <laughs> and come over here and we'll write the recipe for Planter's Punch. In case y'all want to make it, this is not a one bottle drink. <laughs> Day 28. It is a specialist ingredient that you only need a quarter uh, ounce of drink. Narca, Note, um, but you know, it's a tiki life. By the way, if I, I don't know if I said this is where I've gotten a lot of my tiki recipes. Okay. So we have one ounce lime juice. Three fourths ounce. Um, Demerara syrup. I use 
there's sugar. Shh, don't tell. A quarter ounce of St. Elizabeth. Wait, no, yeah, St. Elizabeth Allspice Dram. Three ounces of blended aged rum, Jamaican. Two ounces Angostura bitters. And I did actually have all those other ingredients. <laughs> the only thing I didn't do is make the Demerara syrup. I really should have. If I'm going to do this again, <laughs> uh, though maybe not every day, I think what I need to do is make their Demerara syrup, make their cinnamon syrup. Those are the two that have really been holding me back, not having those. Because I think the Demerara might have a little bit of sugar or uh, vanilla. So interestingly, this does not have very much shimmer in it. That I can see, although it's starting to come out. And, wow, this is actually almost dry. But you can see how thick that coat was by how it's, like, bled through. I think, though, since it's not very dry and it was super thick, we're going to leave it and not do the calendar page together because I don't want to get it, make an even bigger mess than usual. So she says, I have ink all over my fingers. These things happen. So here we are in our cenote. Um, have you ever been to a cenote? Let me know. I hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Bye.